Hey guys, today I'm gonna take you on a journey with me through my full logo design process from start to finish. We'll go over through all of the stages, from the creative brief through research and mood boarding, brainstorming and sketching ideas, to designing the final logo and choosing a color palette. Let's kick things off with our client brief. Spice Root is an e-commerce platform that's all about delivering authentic, high-quality spices from around the globe right to your doorstep. They are targeting food lovers aged 25 to 55 and their vision is to be the go-to platform for premium spices. Their mission is to enrich culinary journeys and their personality is as diverse and adventurous as the flavors they bring. With this brief in hand, we now know that the logo should embody adventure, warmth and sustainability. It needs to be as vibrant and diverse as the spices themselves reflecting their quality and the passion behind the journey from the farm to the kitchen. The logo must also be adaptable, working seamlessly across both print and digital formats while conveying a sense of eco-conscious trade. Now that we have our client brief, it's time to kickstart our actual logo design process for Spice Root. The very first stage of my process is always research, competitor analysis and gathering more information about the brand and the industry. This is super important as we get to generate more ideas, choose a suitable brand strategy and stand out from the competitors. Here's what we have so far. The key characteristics of an online shop like Spice Root are the following. First, high quality. This can be showcased through the use of high resolution detailed photos that capture the richness of the spices and their products. Next, educational content. This includes offering original recipes, engaging blog posts and more, providing value and insights into the world of spices. Transparency. An essential aspect that aims to emphasize the authenticity and fair trade practices behind the sourcing of the spices of fostering trust and integrity. Sustainability, a vital principle for Spice Root reflected in eco-conscious product packaging design, aligning with the brand's commitment to responsible sourcing and environmental care. During the research stage, I've also identified some key trends in the spices industry in 2023. Natural and organic imagery, authentic cultural references, bold colors, hand-drawn elements, minimalistic design and storytelling. So now it's time for stage number two, brand strategy and creative direction. Based on our initial research, here are some ideas for the design strategy. The brand strategy for Spice Root is built on taking customers on a flavorful journey through the world's most exotic spices. They have a mission to connect cultures and create unforgettable culinary experiences and the target audience extends from culinary enthusiasts and chefs to travelers and eco-conscious consumers. Spice Root isn't just about selling spices. Their brand personality embodies traits like adventure, curiosity and cultural awareness, while values like sustainability, quality and exploration are at the core. Spice Root promises an adventurous culinary journey through content marketing, community engagement, collaborations and creative visual identity. Next, we have the creative strategy. For Spice Root's creative design strategy, we are crafting a combination mark logo that's a lively mix of symbol and word mark showcasing the authenticity and diversity of the brand. We'll be incorporating a vibrant imagery that celebrates the word of spices and we'll be using a modern script font that speaks to quality and adventure. We're also gonna focus on warm, earthy tones mixed with rich colors that bring the spices to life. In addition, custom illustrations will depict the variety spice root offers all tied together with unifying patterns. The packaging will be eco-friendly and to top it off, we'll provide a sneak peek into real-world applications from packaging to digital platforms platforms to see how the brand will shine in everyday scenarios. Based on our initial research and brand strategy, it's time to gather some visual inspiration and create our mood board. Next, I'm gonna create a suitable mood board to better show the client the visual style we're aiming for. Here, I'm including reference images, suitable typography, color palette references, logo style inspiration and product design inspiration. From our mood 
mood board, you can now see the direction we are taking. An adventurous yet contemporary typography style infused with a warm color palette that mirrors the rich hues of the spices. We are also exploring pattern-based packaging that resonates with the authenticity of the products. The photography should spotlight the spices in action, capturing moments of joy as people savor the process of cooking their favorite meals. With our mood board in place, let's dive into Procreate and start experimenting with different design concepts. For this project, I've picked out several suitable typefaces from Adobe Fonts, so let's start experimenting and customizing them. One of those typefaces really captures the essence of adventure and authenticity. Let's clear everything else and dive into shaping the word mark. Incorporated a chili pepper symbol into the combination mark to represent the spices. The word marks flowing letters are all about the journey, the travel and the very route the spices take to get to your kitchen. I also used the pencil tool to personalize the letters in the design. If you're not sure how to customize typography, I've got a whole video that explains the pencil tool inside and out. Just go ahead and click here to watch it. Now let's also create a monogram for our brand, giving us a standout version that will also work perfectly as a social media profile picture. Finally, we also need a color palette for our brand. Let's explore several options and see which one resonates with our initial brief. Final step, we'll craft some mock-ups and prepare the logo for presentation. This way, the customer will be able to truly envision their logo in use. Let's see how some of these come to life in action. There you have 
covered a complete journey through designing a logo from start to finish. From the initial research through mood board creation, sketching ideas and finalizing or tailor mockups, we've covered everything. What we've done for Spice Root today reflects their adventurous spirit and authentic quality. We've managed to merge the journey, the flavors and the cultures into a single symbolic mark. Logo design is all about taking a complex brand identity and transforming it into a visual that is simple yet powerful. It's all about connecting with the brand's vision and mission, making it resonate with the target audience. Thanks so much for watching today's video. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below and I'll be sure to check them out. I hope you found this video on logo design helpful. And if you did, don't forget to give it a like, subscribe to my channel and hit that bell for more videos like this one. If you're looking for free design resources, be sure to check my website at Alpenodo Design and go to the resources page. You will find a link to all of the freebies in the description box below. And if you have more free time, check out this video where I show you how to use ChatGPT for logo design. Thanks again so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.